these nails i've had them on for three weeks like three weeks they look in real crazy right now but they have been on can you see it but yeah they've been on for three weeks three whole weeks and they have not fallen off but they've been getting a little rundown so i'm gonna take these off and then i'll show you guys how i do a new set so keep watching if you want to see how to do it it's very easy and very affordable everything will be linked in my description box in my amazon storefront so you can find everything there hey y'all welcome back to another video today i will be doing my nails and well tonight cabria we just put her down for bed she's not sleeping yet i can hear her but i wanted to do my nails because from what i showed y'all earlier i was doing the gel x nails but those was taking too long to do and then I decided to do it with like a press on glue and this glue is like fire and it's cheap and it lasts like my nails was on for like three weeks I just took them off excuse me so that I could do a new set and I'm using the BT art box nails right here and these are in my Amazon storefront and I will also be using a nail dehydrator and the Beatles brand of the base gel, the nail glue, and the top coat. And all of these are in my storefront. I also will be using my UV light and the glue, which I forgot, hold on. The glue is from Sally's Beauty Supply Store and it's called Beauty Secrets Nail Glue. And this is how it looks. There we go. It's upside down. Looks like that. This glue is so good and it's so cheap. You can find it on Amazon, but I think it's more expensive. But this is good and a little goes a long way. So basically, this is gonna be a really quick video because I'm just gonna do one hand to show you guys. Like, I'm literally about to show y'all and put it up because I'm not putting it down here and getting all the angles and all that right now because I don't know how to do it. But um, this video is for my friend Antoinette. I'm gonna tag her right over there so you guys can follow her and her cute little family and you know, the group chat. This for y'all so that y'all could follow along and do it yourselves because this is it right here. Okay, let's get started. So first, Obviously, you have to clean your nails and buff it and all of that. I'm just gonna buff it just to roughen it up a little bit. First, you want to go in with the dehydrator to make sure all of the oils are off of your nail. I already wiped my hands with a, with my nails with a cotton uh, ball and some alcohol too, just in case. But I just put this all over my nail. And then we get the nails. And it has all of the sizes on there. And what I like to do, oh my god, my hair is in face. What I like to do is I like to put the glue on my nail and the glue on this nail and then apply it. So you want to size it so that it is all over your nail like both ends i know y'all can't see that but here basically on both sides side walls covering and then i leave it on there so i just take my glue 
I put it on the nail here, like a few drips. And then I put a few drips here so it doesn't have any air bubbles. And then I just push it on for like 30 seconds or 60 seconds. And that's it. It's really good glue. And then I wipe off the excess of the glue. And then I just twist it off. So it should look like this. I haven't really found a way to clean off the extra glue, like for real, for real. Usually I use like a wooden stick or something so it's not sticking to my skin, but I like to use a lot more glue than less glue because you can always clean it up. I just gotta find a good way to clean it. So I'm gonna go in with my index. All of the nails are on. You can't see. I'm just trying to focus my face. So yeah, all the nails are on. There's little tips. I'm gonna file those down, and then we're gonna go in with the base coat glue and top coat. So I really like this glue because it has like this tip, this tip on the yellow part right there. Okay, so like that yellow part, it goes in here and you stick it in there so it never clogs the top. So you don't ever have to cut the tip or anything like that. And it just works. So I'm gonna just file these little tip things off. And then we're just gonna go in with the base coat. And I like to cure everything for like 60 seconds. So I just put a coat on each nail. try your hardest not to get any of this on your skin and then I just put it under the light for 60 seconds which you can't see maybe I should lower it let me see ah there you go the light <laughs> and I do sometimes I put it most of the time I put the gloves on to protect my hands from the UV light, but right now I'm rushing. I started this at 9.30. I'm trying to see if I can finish both hands by 10. So, yeah.
Bend the neon blue. Are you gonna mix it? And then the top coat. She get a bigger bowl. Mm -hmm. It's supposed to be a piece myself. Even though you go back, mm -hmm. that don't make no sense. That forces you to make a mess. I make a mess. Yeah, you always do. And we are all done. Focus. Oh gosh, the battery's gonna die. All work. Okay, so my nails are all done. Let me bring y'all closer. Uh, okay, so my nails are all done. 
they look like this. Let me see my face out so I can focus. They look like that. And then I want to end it with putting some cuticle oil. Oh my god, this is my bad hand. I can't record my other hand because my camera's gonna die. I gotta do better. So you just put some cuticle oil around your cuticles, make it real cute. I know I told Caleb to close the door so I didn't hear anything, but he is just naturally loud. But yeah, so this is how we're looking. Look at that. Super cute. Y'all better stop paying on people and do y'all own nails. Anyways, <laughs> thank you guys for watching this video and I will see you in the next one.